Howdy, y'all. It's Ryan from RA Music, deep in the heart of Texas. That's where I'm not at right now. This actually is a Warefoot shirt, not an RNA shirt. I'm in Escondido, California at Vola Guitars USA HQ and offices with my man Greg G Money Vola. What's up? Greg is manning the camera, and uh, I've been out here for a couple of days doing some filming and business stuff. And uh, I got a customer for RNA who's super interested. He's already bought a couple of Volas from us, actually. But he was particularly interested in a specific model that they just happened to have at the warehouse that we just came from. And we're going to open it up, take a look at it, and let, uh, let him see it. Maybe take it back to Texas. Maybe sell it. We'll find out what happens. All right, so let's open up this sucker. Where's your shoes? Uh, I took them off because Volas are made in Japan, and so we took our shoes off. Oh my God, my shoes. Yeah. And it's super comfortable. I've been wearing shoes all day. All right, so let's open this up. Ugh. I'm gonna make a mess in Greg's office. I do this in my office too, so it's fine. I will clean it up later. <laughs> All right, very nice gig bag. I've opened a few of these before. So let's see what we got. I mean, I know what it is. But you guys don't know what it is. Come on. It is a Vola Oz 22 HH in Fiesta Red. Which is a nice red. You know, it's not overbearing. It's not like fire engine red. Which is nice. Dual humbuckers. Trim. Five-way switch, rosewood fretboard, lovely one-piece maple neck, Godo tuners, very nice. Those are nice ones. Made in Japan, belly carve, spoon cut. I like this. That's a nice touch. Yeah. So we've had quite a few people actually request. I've already sold one of these. Actually, a Fiesta Red, dual humbucker. Um, it's been interesting the amount of people who have asked about the dual humbucker version. We've sold a couple of the HSS as well, but lately people have been asking about the HH version. So, oh, oh yeah, reverse headstock on this one. Is there a particular reason it's a reverse headstock? Is that an option for all of them or is it just? Mainly on the Fiesta Red and oh. the blacked out. So the blackout and the Fiesta Red has the reverse. That's kind of cool. I like that. Yep. So I'm going to take some pictures <laughs> and send these to uh, my customer and go, hey, man. So you want us to ship this back to Texas to send to you, or what would you like? Cool. Awesome. Well, let's plug it in, play it a little bit. I'm no Robert Baker, but I'm going to play just a little bit. We'll play it on, uh, what do you got? Oh, Rev. Nice little rev there. Dynamus. So we'll plug it on the Dynamus real quick, play a little bit. See what we think. Catch you on the flippity flop! <laughs> Thank you. 
There's some sound samples. That's just, I'm just using the Video Mic Pro Rode microphone on the camera, so not too fancy schmancy with the microphones, but you get the idea. So, yeah, pretty sexy guitar. I like these a lot. The thing I like about Vola, particularly, is I like that it's definitely inspired by, you know, kind of a classic guitar, but with some different contours and curves, you know? So, you kind of, if you play one of these, it's, you kind of stand out a little bit. Definitely a nod to the past, but with some a little bit more futuristic, you know, looks. Which I like that personally. I like I like to play something a little different that not everybody has played. Right? Very cool. All right. So be sure and check these out. Go check out Vola's website. Come to our website, Art and Music. We're gonna have plenty of more Volas incoming soon. Uh, you'll see a lot from us from the Dallas Guitar Show coming in a few months. Vola booth. Bolas at RNA. I'm super excited.